fire extinguisher. It's fine. For putting out fires. I've got one in the car, but I may need something bigger. There's a fellow around the corner reckoning to set fire to himself. Yes, thank you. We're on top of that. How much can I give you for these? Mm. Nice glasses. Well, he can send himself to paradise. That's his choice, but he's not taking my eyebrows with him. Oh, what you think I give a toss about what you do? You just bloody scum. You like pigs. You like animals. Do we know his name? Liam Hughes, 23, unemployed, smackhead. What's he upset about? His ex. His ex. She finished with him three days ago. Now she's sleeping with his best bud. Got a high-ranking, highly trained specialist expert police negotiator on his way over from Wakefield. ETA? It's basically that she would make it. Go close down the comedy department. What an only! You even barbecue! You come any close, I'm gonna set myself off. All right. What's happening, Liam? I don't know what you bought that for. Well, if you accidentally fireball yourself, yeah, well, you're, you're gonna get bummed. And believe you me, right. it's not a good look. How's it all come to this then, lad? I've been humiliated. Humiliated? But I don't want to talk about it. All right. Okay. You know, actions speak louder than words. Okay. Can I just say this though, Liam? The light is making me nervous. You've had a lot to drink and you've got the shakes and you might press it without intending to and I'd like to put it down. Just leave me alone, you stupid bitch. Yeah. You're upset, I understand that. The point I'm making is that with all these fumes and frankly, I don't know how you're staying conscious, you could go up any second whether you intend to or not. And once you go up, you won't just go up a bit, you'll go up a lot. And the other big thing to say is it hurts. Three seconds in, you'll be screaming at me to put you out. Seven seconds in, you'll be begging me to shoot you. I've got a negotiator on his way to you, but he's stuck in traffic. OK. So it's a big thing to keep the subject engaged in conversation. Yeah, I think we've got that covered. I'm Catherine, by the way. I'm 47. I'm divorced. I live with my sister, who's a recovering heroin addict. I have two grown-up children, one dead, one who doesn't speak to me, and a grandson, so... Why? Fine, it speaks to you. It's complicated. Let's talk about you. 